Let us see how to create a multi node private network using Keth. So, the initial step is to create Genesis block for both nodes because if two nodes want to communicate with each other, they should have the Genesis block with the same Genesis configuration. So, I already have created a Genesis block using the puppet using the default parameters. So, let's go ahead and create the Genesis block. So, open a command prompt get hyphen hyphen data dar node 1 init genesis.json and the same for node 2. We also need accounts on node 1 and node 2 so let's create that also. So account new The same for node 1. So if we look at our structure, you can see this is the, our current structure. Now, the next thing we need to do is to run the boot node, which will coordinate the communication between these nodes. So let's go ahead and do that using the command boot node hyphen gen key boot key. So every node in the network has actually an address called enode address and boot node's address is generated based on the boot key. So let's create that. Now let's run the boot node based on the boot key generated. So using the command boot node hyphen node key and the boot key then we are positive and address 30310. So we will be running that on the 30310 port. Now we have our boot node. So this is the enode address for the boot node. So copy that because we will be using that in our command when we are going to run the node 1 and node 2. So now let's go ahead and run node 1. So open another command prompt and enter the command for executing or running node 1. Run node 1. So let's check the boot node. You can see we have established connection with the boot node. Now let's run the second node. Open another command prompt. And run the second node. While running the second node, you need to check one or two things. The first thing is the port should be different than the node one and the boot node and the http port should be different from the node one and the network ID should be same and you need to check if the boot node address is the same now if we check the boot node we can see both node has established connection because we can see the address of both nodes now let's go ahead and start mining on one node so that we can see that the other node will import the mined blocks so let me start the mining on node 1. So let's go ahead and attach a command prompt. Get attach IPC colon miner dot start. We check the mining has started and if we check the other node You can see the block has been synchronized. So this is how you create a multi-node private network using Geth.